Good morning. <coughs> I'm not really awake yet. It is 8.45 and <laughs> yeah, the surprise, um, um, <laughs> it's not the nicest surprise. Um, all the dealers of the uh, Laxo Poker Room got a call and uh, there's a meeting at 9.30 this morning. Um, I have a bad feeling about that. Maybe we all get a raise, <laughs> but uh, I guess the percentage of that or the odds on that are really bad. Uh, I'm not getting that bad. Um, it looks like we're gonna close the Luxor Poker Room. I'm not sure yet, but that's what I think they're gonna tell us. Fuck. Let's hope uh, they just want to tell us how great we are, how good the poker room is running and that we're going to do a really big promotion and they had to wake us up in the morning to go there and tell us that. <laughs> the odds on that bad might be really bad too. But think positive, then I have more time to vlog. <laughs> how about that? Time to lay on the pool. <laughs> Unfortunately, we did not get a race. <laughs> um, yeah, so the poker room is closing. Um, and uh, not good for us dealers. Uh, it's closing at the 18th of June. So last day will be the 18th of June. But uh, all the promotions stopped right now. And for all your players out there, they're here um, next week, Saturday. That's gonna be the, let me see. Uh, Saturday, the 27th of May. We're gonna give away all the, the, comp, uh, the, all the promotion money uh, that's left. So it's gonna be high hand promotion and stuff. Uh, from uh, 10 o'clock in the morning till 5 uh, in the morning. So make sure you come and get some free money in the poker room. I gotta figure out what I'm doing. They offer, uh, they still have uh, some positions in other properties that they're gonna fill up with poker players and uh, po with poker dealers. Um, and they um, they're reserved for the dealers from 
the Luxor. So I'm not 100% sure what I want to do. Um, I'm going to figure something out. Maybe I'm going back playing full-time poker instead of dealing. It's the best time right now. The World Series is coming. The games are good. So make sure uh, next Saturday everybody sits in our poker room. Too bad. I really like that place. Okay, here is uh, another package, and this comes from Frank from Canada. <laughs> Someone is really funny. <laughs> hey. There's a Starbucks mug in here. <laughs> is that the wrong address? Did I get it? No, it's my address. It says my name. There is no, there's no note. Maybe there's a note in here. Oh yeah, there's a note in here, good. Poker crowd. Can I, can I, uh, blah, blah. Poker crowd. Canada recognized uh, you as the official winner of the weight loss contest between you and the trooper. You were stud, um, you were stead up at wait time, but took it like a champ. We never found out what the punish punishment was supposed to be for the loser, so we thought we'd send you the Canada Cup. Uh, the same kind trooper likes to collect. Enjoy your coffee. And yes, I do drink coffee. <laughs> oh, there's something in there too. Canada mug. Uh, I'm also in close a card protector that I'd like you to play at Caesar's Palace. May Yoda bring you the force and good fortune. Uh, I enjoy your videos. You're funny and down to earth. Keep them, keep them coming. Thank you very much. Uh, could you shout out uh, <laughs> Vif Les Nordic Wicks? No, pff, I have. Okay, I I have no idea how to say that. But I have a little toy. Now I hold it. Hold it next to the camera. Vif Les Nordic. Vif Les Nordic. <laughs> I don't know if that's the right thing to say, uh, the right way to say, but Wiefle Nordic, Nordic, uh, whatever that means. Um, for my friend Daniel, who watches your vlogs uh, religiously, uh, and I mean shout it out loud. I mean stand up, arm in the air like they about to score a goal. Shout out, old NHL hockey team from. Oh, okay, that's a okay. Wie Flanodix! 
Now all my neighbors think I'm totally, I'm done. I'm, I'm totally out of my mind. Frankois? Fucking shit. I have no idea how to say these names. I'm so sorry. Frankois? Francis? Frankois, AK-007. Uh, so I, tell, I just say James Bond. From uh, Vancouver in Canada. Oh, by, by the way, from Vancouver. I was in Can Vancouver three times and I, I always stayed at the River Rock Casino and it was um, one of the craziest games I've ever played in. It was a 2-5 game or a 3-5 game. I, I think they have different blinds. It's not 2-5, it's 3-5 or something. And this was the craziest game and I played all over the world. Believe me, I was everywhere. But that was the craziest game I ever played in. And they're all locals. But it was crazy. It was just crazy. Okay, thank you very much. And I just saw in the muck is the little Yoda. You know what? That is really nice that you sent me this one because <laughs> as you see here in the back I have a little loader too, but my transportation was not that great and I broke it. So now I have a new one and this one is going to play at, what was it? The Caesars Palace, yes. I'm filming. <laughs> okay, so after a great dinner at the buffet at the Rio, we're all full and we're going to go and play poker at the Caesars. Thank you very much. Um, I'm playing with the Yeti from James Bond, from 007, James Bond. Exactly. Oh, wish me luck. Why is that always that I have to eat as much as I can when I go to the buffet? I don't That's get it. That's the question I can ask you. That is so, that is, <laughs> that is so wrong. You know, you want to have something for your money, but it doesn't make any sense. You just fill yourself up with so much food that you can't even walk anymore. But it was a good food, baby. It was good. Yes, it was good. At least it's gonna hold. At least it's gonna hold up till tomorrow evening. <laughs> yeah, right. Tomorrow morning you're gonna wake up, baby. You wanna have breakfast? <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kannst du dich auch da hinsetzen? That's Yoda. Who is it? Yoda. Yoda? I don't know, Do know who that? it is. From, what, what, what is Star Wars? We, the first table was horrible that I was sitting on, but um, the other table looked from far, it looked really, really good. And I thought, okay, let's do a table change. So I changed the table and this game is amazing. It's just wild as it can get. Um, I record, um, oh, I, I took a picture of one of the hands, so this one here is the first hand. And I filmed one of the other, uh, uh, one other hand, uh, it's this one here. Jacks are way worse than Queen Five, sir. Jacks are way worse than Queen Five. You are a grown man, and you get to play your chips any way you want. That's the beauty of this game. However you want to play it, sir. I know you want to get me, sir. I know you do. And guys, that should uh, show you that there is uh, all that theory that you're reading in a book. It does not work in the one-two games here. This is. Um, this is wild poker. If you have dead tables, there's, there's, you have to have, you have to be a little bit more tight. If you don't want to gamble, this is. Uh, I mean, I love this game. This is the perfect game for my, um, the first, the perfect table for my game. Um, this is just. I want to have one of these tables every single day. That would be perfect. But um, you have to, you have to search for it. So, um, I did not get any hands so far, and uh, I'm still sitting there with my start stack. 
Um, I'm waiting. I just have to wait. I have to wait. I cannot uh, call 25, 1, 2, 25 uh, before the flop with uh, Queen 3. They, they can do it. I can't. I, I'm not doing that. I'm not blowing away money. I wait for the, for the right timing and then I'm going for it. And there is no bluffing on the table. There is, you cannot bluff. There's none. None of these players on my table is bluffable. They gonna call you till the fucking end. No matter what they have. 100%. So, like I said, this is the perfect table for me. I'm going back and hopefully I get a hand. <laughs> See you later. Six dollars on the side. Oh, what do you want? No, no. Straight. I knew you had it. I didn't, I didn't know. I thought you had a set. Oh, Something's going on over there. I don't know what it is, but I want to see what it is. <laughs> okay, so I'm leaving the poker room. Um, I'm a little bit pissed. <laughs> a little bit more than that. Yeah, you saw, you saw. Mariana just came back from playing the buffalo machine, and she saw the last hand. It's, um, it's a little bit frustrating, but it is what it is. So, um, yeah, the last hand, um, it was actually a 1-2-20 game or a 1-2-25 game because the, the open bet was, or the open race was always 20 or 25 bucks. So, um, there were somebody open raised for 20 and uh, there were four callers for 20 and I uh, looked in the big blind with uh, four of diamonds and five of diamonds. And um, I had about 300, 320 in front of me. Um, or no, uh, it was more. It was more. It was more. But maybe 360 or 370, something like this. Uh, almost 400. So um, we see five ways the flop, and it is um, the flop is Ace of Diamonds. Uh, nine of diamonds, six of diamonds, uh, no, two of diamonds. Um, so I flopped a flush. Right away, uh, right away, I bet seventy dollars. Everybody folds except of the guy on the uh, on the button. He pushed all in. Uh, Three hundred and ninety, I think, was the count. Yeah. Uh, the history of the of the table of the guy um, he's a wild player so uh, I'm not folding my flop flush there we have to go to the oh you cash out okay you go cash out and okay so um, I make the call and uh, I said um, I flopped the flush and he said yeah I flopped the flush too I said okay then and then <laughs> and then uh, I said okay then then you have a better hand than I have because my flush is not that high. So I turned around my 4-5 of diamonds and the turn brings uh, I think a 2 of clubs and the river is a uh, jack of diamonds. And he turns around king of diamonds, 10 of clubs. So he did not flush, uh, flop the flush. Uh, and I said, 
didn't you just say you flopped the flush too? And he said, no, no I did not say What did he say? I didn't say that. I had four to the flush. Okay, so everybody, everybody looked at him like, what a fucking douchebag. I'm not getting mad on the table anymore because I want that idiot's call like this. And I said, okay, nice hand. I smiled at him. I said, nice hand. Um, the bad thing is, uh, all my winnings were gone. And uh, so now I ended up the session because we're going to leave. Uh, that was the last hand I played any, uh, anyway because Mariana showed up. So uh, I lost 120 bucks. That's it. Just 120. The bad thing is I could be a good winner for tonight. Um, but instead of that, I lost. So I'm sorry, James Bond. It did a, did a good job, but um, yeah, finally I have to leave. <laughs> I know you would say, why can you leave that good game? Hey. In Vegas, there's always a good game. You just have to find it. And uh, we have to stand up tomorrow morning, early, uh, tomorrow morning early. It's already late. So we're going home. Okay? There's always a good game. Yeah. <laughs> I guess she's more pissed than I am because that was a really douchebag move. Yeah, because what he did. people like that calling for... I don't just for luck. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I want them to call all the time with that hand or oh, push with that hand. Okay, so time to go home. Good night. Was hast du jetzt drauf geschossen? Auf alles.